everybody, it's Mareka again. Welcome to Grace Kids Online and the adventure of following Jesus. I'm so happy that you have joined us today. Last week we started the series called The Big Sandbox. Now let me remind you what that's all about. You see, God created us for love and Jesus came to the earth to show us just how much he loves us. Jesus invites all of us to join him and be his forever friend. Everyone can play in the big sandbox. Now last week we discovered that Jesus thinks children are very important and he loves them so much. Who loves you boys and girls? That's right, Jesus loves you. I wonder what we're going to discover today. Come on, Let's go and join Ollie and our friends from the Wonder Clubhouse so we can sing to Jesus and hear our story for today. here and I'm so glad you can join me on this big adventure today. I'm searching all over the sandy desert for buried treasure. Psst. It's just me, Poppy. I'm loving the new sandbox so much that I'm pretending it's a big desert and I'm searching for buried treasure. This is gonna be so much fun. 
Yes, yes, I found just the place. This is where we need to dig for the buried treasure. Poppy, Grandma's here. She really wants to spend some time with you. Hurry home, Poppy. Oh, wow. I completely forgot that Grandma was coming over today. Whenever she visits, she loves for me to play her favorite game with her. Go fish. But I really don't want to stop playing in the new sandbox yet. What should I do? Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hi there, Poppy. Ho, ho. Playing explorer, are you? Hey, Ollie. Yep, I sure am. I'm having so much fun playing in the new sandbox. The problem is, my grandma's coming over to visit, and I don't want to stop playing in the sandbox yet. Ollie, what should I do? Trying to figure out what to do? I have the perfect story for you. Just listen to this. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. Oh, hey, friends. I'm Justin the Mailman. Look at all of these letters I have today. Friends on a trip. Birthday cards. Oh, and this one is a get well soon card from one sister to another. That reminds me of today's story. Are you ready for it? Great. I'll just put the story mail in the mailbox and... Okay, so today's true story from the Bible happens at a house like this. Two sisters lived there, Mary and Martha, and they were friends with Jesus. One day, they heard Jesus was coming to visit them at their house. They were so excited, and Martha ran off to get everything ready. Do you like to have friends over at your house? Me too. What do you like to play? Uh, raise your hand if you like to color with your friends. Oh, that's so exciting. Raise your hand if you like to eat snacks with your friends. Mmm, yummy snacks. Raise your hand if you like to play outside with your friends. <laughs> That's so great. It's so good to spend time with friends. As soon as Jesus got to Mary and Martha's house, Mary sat right down at his feet. She wanted to hear everything Jesus had to say. Her friend Jesus was here, and she didn't want to miss anything. But Martha... Wait, has anyone seen Martha? There she is. Oh, now she's gone. Martha was very busy. She was here. She was there. She was cooking and cleaning. She was trying to make everything perfect because she loved Jesus so much. And finally, she went to Jesus and said, Make my sister help me. I'm doing all the work. But Jesus told Martha that spending time with him is the best thing to do. She didn't need to be worried about the cooking and the cleaning. He just wanted to spend time with her. That's the kind of friend Jesus is. He doesn't need everything to be just right. He loves us no matter what, and he wants to spend time with you, 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 and you. So we should talk to him and dance and sing songs to him and take walks and thank him for all of the things he's made because Jesus loves spending time with us and wants to be our friend forever. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me. Who loves you? Jesus loves me. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who loves you? Jesus loves me. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. I'll see you next time. So there's your story. It's all true. Jesus wanted to spend time with Mary and Martha. And he wants to spend time with you, too. Thanks, Ali. Goodbye to you. 
Ho! Ho! Wow, what a great story! Martha was so busy with what she was doing, but Mary stopped to spend time with Jesus. Jesus wanted to spend time with both of them, and He wants to spend time with me and you. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Got it! Good! I know what I need to do. I should go spend time with my grandma. Hey, I just got a great idea. Maybe I can read her this story from my Bible so I can spend time with her and Jesus too. She will love that. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! A friend loves at all times. Proverbs 17:17. 17, 17. A friend loves at all times. Proverbs 17:17. 17, 17. Wow, boys and girls, Jesus wants to spend time with us. He wants to be our forever friend and he wants to spend time with us. Now, I wonder how we can spend time with Jesus. Can you tell me? That's right, we can pray and we can read our Bibles. That's how we can spend time with Jesus. Hey because he loves us and he wants to get to know us and we want to get to know him so let's do one of those right now let's talk to Jesus together dear Lord Jesus thank you so much that you love us that you want to spend time with us and that you want to be our forever friend Jesus help us to remember this so that during the week we can pray to you and talk to you and read our Bible to get to know you better. Amen. Well, boys and girls, I really hope that you had fun with us today, that you enjoyed the story and hearing from Ollie and our friends at the Wonder Clubhouse. Well, just stay connected for a little bit longer because there's going to be an activity that will come up on the screen that you can do so that you can remember what you have heard today. And moms and dads, please don't forget, we have a special Faith at Home video for you on our channel. So you can take what your kids have discovered today into the rest of the week. And if you've joined us for the very first time, we would just like to say a big welcome. And we'd love to connect with you. So why don't you connect with us on Facebook or Instagram or pop us an email at gracekids.grace.org.za. We would love to hear from you. Well, that's it from me today. We'll see you guys again next week. Bye. Hey kids, it's activity time again. Today, we are gonna make a watch to show you just how much Jesus wants to spend time with you. Firstly, you'll need the watch worksheets, which you can ask a grown up to find off our website, which is www.grace.org.za forward slash parent dash resources. Then you'll need some crayons, some scissors, glue, and a split pin. What you want to do first is color in all the shapes on your page. Then cut out all the shapes that you've colored in. Take the two rectangles and glue them together back to back. Then take your watch face and glue it onto the bigger circle. Next, you want to put the rectangle with the writing side facing down and glue the circle and the watch face to the back of your rectangle. Then ask a grown-up to help you use the scissors to make a small hole in the center of the watch face and onto the two arrows. You'll see the little dots where you can make the holes. Then take your split pin to attach the arrows to the watch face. Next, 
Glue the two ends of the rectangle together to form your watch strap. Enjoy.